What is going on guys? Grave here. Welcome back to Star Wars Battlefront 2. Today I want to talk about Battlefront 2 and is it a game that you should be going back and trying out. I've been hearing a lot of great things about this game and kind of like yesterday I made a video about Battlefield 5 and kind of talked about some things that I saw that were kind of being approved upon by DICE and some things I still thought were some issues. Now this game is a lot more polished than it was when it first came out and it is an absolute exceptional game in my opinion now, especially for the price that you can get it at if you do not already own it. I've been hearing a lot of good things about this. Some big YouTubers, some big streamers. I mean, even Shroud was playing this game not long ago. If you know who Shroud is, it has had a lot of positive feedback and a lot of the player base coming back. Dice stated that this game has as many players now as it did on release. And when this game was released, it was really hyped up. A lot of people were buying it, but it did have a lot of disappointment with the loot box system and things of that nature. And I waited like a month or so to buy it after release, got it for a little bit cheaper. And I did enjoy it at the time, but it did have some bugs and it still did have that looming kind of you know, cloud kind of hanging over it about the loot box system that kind of disappointed a lot of people and they didn't want to play it or they just kind of gave up on the game or were disgusted with what Dice had done and the EA. So, you know... It was kind of disappointing from the start, but now it's amazing to me is how many people are playing it. It's kind of like a turnaround, in my opinion, of how Dice fixed Battlefield 4, and it got more popular the longer that it was out, or kind of like Rainbow Six Siege. Uh, if you play Siege, Siege to begin with was not that popular. It kind of died off, and then it made this huge kind of comeback, and that's what Star Wars Battlefront 2 has done. This is not the same game you played back in the end of 2017 when it was released. It was released in November of 2017, so it's been out for around a year and a half. There's been a lot of things added. New modes. Some of the modes from the older Battlefront games have kind of reemerged into this game. Uh, of course, there's lots of new heroes, lots of new villains to play as. Um, and a lot of new just character skins and things of that nature. That's another good thing that DICE has done with this game. Yes, you can buy cosmetic items in this game with real-world money. Or you can just play the game, grind it out, earn in-game currency. And you can buy those same cosmetic items you can buy re with real-world money with in-game currency. I think that is a great, great idea. Um, it, 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 like I said, guys, this is not the same game that was released back in the end of November in 2017. This game has totally changed. If it was released today in this state that it is, is, is in now, I think it's probably one of the probably most played games uh, in multiplayer just, than there's been in a while because that is how good it is, especially if you're a Star Wars fan. It does play a little bit more like Battlefield than it ever has to me as of right now. But it is very enjoyable. If you have not played it, definitely give it a look again. There's still going to be lots of content. DICE has stated they're still looking at the big picture. They're going to do a lot more stuff with this game. They have a roadmap that is all, all the way kind of laid out until June. They said there's going to be more to come after June. So this is definitely a game, guys, you could hop in and play. It will still immerse you in that Star Wars universe. It has not lost that kind of luster at all. If, if it kind of even to me, it's even gained more of that kind of Star Wars immersion because it is that much of a better game in my opinion like i said guys if you have not played it in a while definitely give it a try if you have never played it at all you can buy it for extremely cheap especially on the ps4 uh on the store on the psn store it is it is very very cheap so if you have not played it in a while and you do own it definitely give it a go again and if you have not ever played it and you would like to now is definitely the time because i think this game will definitely keep your attention for months to come because it is that much improved and it is that good in my opinion now Leave me a comment and let me know what you think about Star Wars Battlefront 2. And of course, guys, if you like the video, make sure you hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. And make sure you click that bell icon up in the top right corner so you know when all my videos go live. And I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.